How's the recon going? So far, so good. Still, I might need to do some more scouting, just to be safe. Alright. Report back when you found something. Copy. Before that, you sure about this? Yes, I already gave the details to Zeres. Ask him. Alright, over and out. A race of creatures from outside the multiverse. They call themselves the Collectors. They have the ability to copy powers from any being native to the universe that they choose to invade. Copy powers, huh? That is serious. Do we know what they're going to look like? No. If they can copy powers, they can likely change form too. It likely depends on what beings that they choose to copy their powers from. But... They have two things in common. They are one-eyed and have a resonator spike on their back. Now that you mention it, we've received first that there were people who encountered something. Looks exactly as you described them. Probably one of them. When did it happen? A few days ago, Intel says they were all badly injured. All the more reason we need to stay vigilant. <sighs> Things are gonna get a lot more problematic, and we still don't know if they are the collectors. And if they are, we're basically screwed. And that is why Stormer is securing the perimeter as of now. He has some experience dealing with them. Based on this intel. Well, we had most of the teams on missions, and only a few to do some recons. Us included. Stormer is the only one on the grid, so he already had a head start. We should join him. It's dangerous enough to face these beings together, let alone fighting them alone. I heard you. Stormer, can you hear me? We're gonna head up to your position. Any unusual activity? Yeah, loud and clear. Nothing's unusual. Wait. What is it? I found something. Or rather, someone. Damn, it's Centran. The traitor? Yeah, definitely him. Do I engage? Only if it's necessary. Continue spying on him. Help is on the way. We're moving out. So, what would a traitor be doing in a place like this? Ah. Uh. Here. That's much better. And... Looks like the rat's out of its trap. I'm not a rat trap. <laughs> so, to what do I owe the pleasure, Stormer? Mind your own damn business! Says the rat who tried to spy on me. Whatever. So, what's your business, Toa? Don't lump me together with those groups of so-called heroes! You mind your own damn business! <laughs> Is that the best you've got? Enjoying this a little bit too much. Huh. You know how I am in combat. Oh, I know. But that doesn't mean I couldn't take pleasure in this brief moment. Oh? Then how about this? <laughs> well, you find
suddenly landed some hits. Oh, there will be more to come. And backup's coming. So let's enjoy this while we can, shall we? Yes, let's. <laughs> huh? I see that you are both engaging now. And I must ask... May I join this fight? It seems far more interesting than I thought it would be. Huh. You don't look from around here. Or from this world. Collector! Ah, so you know about me. I know all about your kind, monster! So you know what to expect, then. Alright, enough kit chat. You can teleport, is that it? That would be interesting to have. But unfortunately, no. I was only moving fast. That's all. So what now, huh? You're gonna finish me off? Make me suffer? Well, I am sadistic. So that option remains. But... You seem to have a misunderstanding about me. I'm not your enemy, unless you make me so. Why should I believe you? As I have said, I wanted to join the fight. And I would very much like to see what sort of powers you have, personally. Though, you didn't use it. I rely on my skills, and I can use my powers whenever I want. I see, but this is sufficient enough. I don't technically need to see your power, or having to be this close just to copy it. In fact, I can just copy you from afar, but that wouldn't be. Amusing. Hmm. I can't copy you. You're not originally from this universe, are you? No. One of your kind destroyed my universe. My condolences, then. Just you watch. I'll avenge my brethren and find the others. Good luck to you, then. I know nothing of your universe, hence I am not the perpetrator, but if you require assistance on hunting down my kind, I'll gladly extend my hand. You what? Shocking, is it not? I assure you I will not go back on my word. Do take your time to think. I'll be waiting, but for now... <laughs> ah, back up, I see. Step away from him. You're not from around here, are you? <clears throat> Who knows, but... <clears throat> You're one of a kind, aren't you? <laughs> I wouldn't say that to myself, but I appreciate the compliment. You okay? Yeah, I'll manage. But damn, that hurts. Is he strong? Yeah, I'd say so. But he might have more up his sleeves. That I do.
I still haven't properly introduced myself. My name is Alarak, and as you all know, I am a collector. I don't care. I ask you to leave this universe. How unwelcoming. But as I have said to your friend, I am not your enemy. But if it's a fight you want, I'll gladly accept any challenge. Then would you accept mine? Kulta, why are you here? Friend of yours. Foe! It seems you all arrived much earlier, but never mind. I've come to challenge you into a fight, Collector. Alone, to test our might. Then, I will fight all of you. I said alone. Where did he? So much for a challenge. Did you forget about me? I'm not finished yet. Jowler! Well, that stunned me for a bit, but it's not enough. Ironically, this situation happened to your friend earlier. Amusing, is it not? Hmm. So, how do we beat him? It must have something to do with his resonator spike. I've noticed earlier he seemed to be in pain when we shot him. It would seem that we need to work together to defeat him. As if we haven't done that earlier. I have no interest in working with either of you, but this situation deems it necessary. Agreed. So we should forget our conflict and form an alliance. Temporarily, of course. <laughs> this should be fine. Mm. 
Got you now! Well... <clears throat> that most definitely hurts. Unfortunately, it was all only a warm-up. It was fun nonetheless. Yeah, we know. And we're just getting started. Then... I'll have to get serious. I'm not much of a challenge before, right? You shouldn't underestimate me. Remember about my proposal. You see, I was not planning on copying your powers, but you really did pique my interest. Of course, I could have done it sooner, but I feel like I should defeat you first, so that I am worthy of your power. Now, time to claim my trophy. Enough. 
Geller! And you're the last one. Last man standing, huh? You have the elemental power of fire. But can you be my fire? Don't know. But one thing I'm damn sure of. Oh. I'll fight till my last breath. <laughs> so be it. Uh. Ah! Normally, this is the chance that anyone will never let go. Take the opponent's life when they are at their weakest. But, as I have said earlier, and I repeat, I am not your enemy, nor am I your friend, just to be clear of that. And do not worry, I haven't caused any damage to your comrades that could be permanent. I think you've caused more than you realize. True. What now, huh? You're just gonna leave and pretend this never happened? Leave? Yes. Pretend? No. I really enjoy these moments of us battling. Too much, in fact, that I can't even look the other way. It was a moment of a lifetime, as you people would have said. You seem like you know more about us than you let on. Ah. Uh, Curious, aren't you? But... That's a question for another day. I must go now. Chella, is it? I assume this won't be the last time we fight. Until then, be ready. Till we meet again. So, how long are you going to keep on sleeping? Uh, how did we get here? After that battle with Alarak, we were all unconscious. Thankfully, Alpha Zero found us. He brought us here. That android? So, he brought all of us? Well, not all. Colta and Sintran woke up before Alpha Zero even got there. <sighs> so, how long has it been after that fight? Approximately 12 hours. We took quite a beating out there. It's a good thing Alpha Zero found us before our injuries got even worse. I woke up just a few hours ago. I don't see Stormo around. He winked out after he had woken up a few hours ago, almost as Ares did. Hey there, Alpha Zero. Chala, how are you feeling? Better than before. Did Stormo tell you where he's going? As you all know him, he likes to keep things to himself. But there is no need to worry about him. As of now, my top priority is to hear your report. Commander Lusvik's orders. Shouldn't you ask Zeris when he woke up earlier? Commander Lusvik wishes to hear the report when all team members are present. However, that seems to change since Stormer might not return. Anytime soon.
Okay, for starters, the intel that Stormer gave to us was accurate, however minor it is. But here's where things start to get serious. What he said. From what we can gather, this collector, Alarak as he called himself, seems to have an ulterior motive. Or roughly, he's unpredictable. Going on from that, the collectors are... Come out! I know you're here! <laughs> I wonder how you were able to find me. Humor me. How did you find me? That's not important. I've come to discuss your proposal. Oh. Then, have you made your decision? I did. And I accept. I want you to help me with my revenge. To the one who destroyed my home. <laughs> I honestly thought that you would take much longer time to think. But no matter, time is of the essence. Just so you know, this doesn't change anything between us. I still don't trust you. I know, and I don't particularly care. I have been living this kind of life ever since. Not familiar with this handshake kind of thing is what everyone does when they meet. Or in this case, sealing the deal, is it not? You are going to hold on to your words, right? Do not fret. I guess this is what everyone says. I am a man of my word. Alright then, it's a deal. <laughs> it's a deal.